Unit 4 멀티미디어 활용 1. 멀티미디어실 컴퓨터실 이용 We are going to use computers for today's lesson. Everybody, please sit in front of a computer. Shall we turn on the computer? Yes, go ahead. Wait till your computers boot up. It's done. Now, double-click the rainbow icon. Click the Start button and wait. 멀티미디어실 컴퓨터실 이용 When we need to use the computers, we'll go to the multimedia room. The multimedia room is on the fifth floor at the end of the corridor. Ask the computer teacher for the key to the multimedia room. You have to be ready in the computer room before the bell rings. Don't forget to lock the classroom when you are coming to the multimedia room. Please turn the lights off when you leave the computer room. The class president should check if all the computers are off when leaving. There are some rules to follow when using the multimedia room. Computer room rules are posted on the wall. Please follow the rules. Never bring drinks to the multimedia room. Computer 사용 We're going to use computers for today's lesson. Everybody, please sit in front of a computer. Please share a computer with your partner for today. That computer is out of order. Find another one. Turn on the power. Turn on the computer. Turn off the computer. Wait a minute while it boots up. Has your computer finished booting up? Has anyone's computer failed booting? What do you see on the screen? Do you see the school logo? Click the mouse. Click the right mouse button. Insert the CD. Can you see a book-shaped icon in the background? Double-click that icon. Click Start on the first page. Press the Open Close button. Hit the Enter key. Put your headsets on. Start the program and wait. Computer 사용 시 주의 사항 Be careful with the computers. These computers are really expensive, so please take care. Don't use the computers for personal use. Don't save personal data on the computer. Don't delete anything. Don't download any programs unless I tell you to. Don't chat through the messenger. You must not play games during the class. Don't forget to turn off the monitor. Don't press the keyboard so hard. You should not touch the screen. 2. E. Internet 활용 Please connect to the Internet now. Open your favorite web portal or web search engine. Is Naver okay too? That's perfectly okay. Now, find a site that introduces Korean traditions. Type in Korean traditions in the search box. There are so many results! I know. Follow the links and try to find the best site. Internet 접속 및 검색 Can you see the Internet icon? Start the Internet. Access the Internet. Please connect to the Internet. Double-click the Explorer icon on the screen. Who's having trouble getting onto the Internet? Now, log in to the school homepage. Follow the link. Click on the link. Let's do some web surfing. Let's find the information we need. Do you know the website address? Type in the address in the address bar. Please search Shakespeare. Type Shakespeare in the search field. 
Find a site that introduces Korean traditions. Search for information about this movie on the internet. What are the results? How many results did you get? What is the URL of that site? Please add the site to your bookmark. Don't open websites that have nothing to do with our lesson. I guess you all use the internet very often. Which sites do you usually go to? I visit Naver often. Do you use Facebook? This site provides lots of useful information. What do you usually do with the internet? We can play games, do shopping, study, search information, write emails, and so much more with the internet. Blogging is another popular activity. Blogs are very useful when posting photos and writing diaries. Too much online games can harm you. One hour a day is enough. We are going to make our class homepage. Please post your homework on your class homepage. You can also post questions on our class band. Please upload your pictures on our band. Write about the things you have learned today on the board. Please download the exercise file from the resource room. Please email your work to me. Let's learn about internet languages used in English speaking countries. Let's have a look at emoticons in the USA. How are they different from the emoticons we use? Netiquette. When using the internet, there is some etiquette to follow. Internet etiquette is called netiquette. Netiquette is a set of rules you have to follow when you use the internet. Why do we need netiquette? Think of the etiquette we need when we are on the internet. In this handout, you'll see 10 netiquette rules you must follow. Sam. Tonjagigi Hwaryong. Let's watch a movie. What is the movie about? It's about animals in danger. It lasts for about 15 minutes. Let me play it now. The volume is too low. We can't hear at the back. Oh, sorry. I'll adjust the volume for you. How's that? Is it loud enough now? 전원 켜기 및 끄기 Where's the power? Is the power on? Please turn on the power. Push the power button. Please press the on button twice. Turn the switch on. Switch it on. I forgot to switch it on. I forgot to turn on the power of the TV. Please turn it off. Turn the switch off. Switch it off. Now that we've finished, we have to turn off the power. Mind the cable. Is it plugged in? Would you like to plug it in? Don't forget to pull the plug out. Please unplug the monitor. The switch for the screen is on the right-hand side of the blackboard. Can you all hear the sound? Can you hear the sound clearly? Is the sound clear? Can you hear well at the back? Is the volume all right? You can't hear the sound. Is it loud enough? Is it too loud? Is it too quiet? The sound is too loud. The sound is a bit too small. Let me adjust the volume. Let me turn up the volume. Please turn down the volume. The volume is just fine. It's done now. CD 사용 및 오디오 재생 Please put in the CD. Please eject the CD. I'll play the CD for you. Play track 10, please. Let's skip this track. Let's play the song on the CD. Sorry, I brought the wrong CD. 
Jin, please go and fetch the CD on my desk. Do you want to listen to the song on the CD? Do you want to listen to it again? It's on track three. Maybe I should go forward. Do I need to go backward? Press this button to go back. Press the stop button to finish. Press this red button here and it'll start recording. I don't want any scratches on the CD. The audio file is on the USB stick. DVD 사용 및 비디오 보기 I'll play the DVD. Let me put in the DVD. We're going to watch a video clip. Shall we watch a movie? How about watching an exciting animation? I found a very interesting video on this DVD. I'll play the file. Please be quiet while I operate the video. Move back a little if you can't see the screen well. This video is a scene from a movie. This movie lasts for 15 minutes. The subtitles are in English. This movie doesn't have subtitles. Try not to look at the subtitles. I have put a strip of paper over the subtitles. Now I'll remove the strip. Check how well you've understood. Did you enjoy the movie? Would you like to watch it again? Do you want me to play it again? I'll go back and play it again. Let's skip this part. I'll pause here. Try to think what will happen next. Let's practice the expressions with the video. OHP 사용 Please set up the OHP. Pull down the screen. Maybe I should roll down the screen. Please adjust the screen with the remote control. Everyone, look at the screen. I'll put it on the OHP so that everyone can see it. Is it out of focus? Let me adjust the focus. Does it need to be sharper? Is the screen tilted? Could you straighten up the transparency film? Turn the transparency film upside down. The film seems to be the wrong way round. Please turn the lights off. Please draw the curtains. Don't touch the lens. Don't look into the lamp because it's too bright. Sa, 기술적 문제 해결. Oh, there's no sound. Something seems to be wrong with this computer. Was it like this in other classes too? No, it worked fine in the morning. Hmm, is there anyone who's good at computers? Maybe it might work if you restart the computer. Good idea. Let's try that. 문제가 생겼을 때 It's out of order. I think it's broken. The picture is a bit strange. Strange. There's no sound. There's too much noise. We've got a bad connection. There seems to be a problem. Something's gone wrong. The power is not coming on. My phone won't turn on. We've got some problems with the speakers. There seems to be something wrong with the DVD. The CD player isn't working properly. I've checked just a minute ago what's wrong with this. Did you have the same problem before? Did the internet work in other classes? There is no image on the monitor. Whose computer doesn't have any sound? The computer is not booting up. Whose computer is not working well? If you have a problem with your computer, put your hand up. 문제 해결하기 Please check the cable. 
Check if the power is on. Is the computer connected to the TV? Maybe I should start the computer again. Let me adjust the screen. Is there anyone who's good at computers? Does anybody know how this works? Who knows how to fix this? Let's see if I can fix it. Please go fetch the computer teacher. Please help me solve this problem. Maybe I should call the service center. Please be quiet while I get this fixed. Sorry, please read the book while I check the problem. I don't think we can fix it today. Let's do this activity next time after we fix the computer.